Today, leaders of the seven cities came together to try to solve the problem of growing violence. Allison Basil spent the day at that meeting and she has the results. Over the last few weeks, Hampton Road city managers came together to brainstorm ways that police department leaders and city officials across the region can tackle crime together. Today, they presented their plan of action to mayors in the 757. One big thing all Hampton Road city leaders agree on, the rise in crime is hitting all across the region. Violence knows no border. There was a time I used to keep track of those in Hampton. I stopped doing that. It really was disheartening. Today, Hampton Road city officials met again. This time, city managers presented a plan of action to share intelligence and resources to prevent crime as a region. A lot of Norfolk's homicides, the suspects are not from Norfolk. Uh, same is true in Portsmouth and so on. Norfolk City Manager Chip Filer says gangs from other cities are working together. He wants officials to share gang intelligence to address that problem, but also share law enforcement technology and programs to combat all types of crime. A lot of us are buying uh, additional equipment. Um, we're all doing it by ourselves. Uh, there could be some strength in numbers. The city of Norfolk has faced a rash of shootings in the downtown area recently, including three shooting incidents this week. Norfolk Mayor Kenny Alexander says Norfolk police officers are chasing every lead when it comes to any unsolved cases. We're not slacking on pursuing those persons who have committed crimes in the city of Norfolk. We will pursue them, we will arrest them, and bring them to justice. He says he's pleased to see city leaders back together pushing for progress. Some other attainable plans city managers mentioned the potential for teaching conflict resolution in high schools across the 757, working with the courts to create stricter sentences, and police departments officials working together and sharing intel. In Chesapeake, Allison Basil, 13 News Now. The Hampton Roads Planning District Commission and city leaders are also building a regional crime dashboard. The goal is for leaders and police departments to keep an updated log of crimes.